I spent a lot of time teaching students, parents, seniors, and others about Facebook and some of the privacy implications involved with using Facebook. One thing that surprises a lot of people is that Facebook actually tracks your web browsing data when you are on sites outside of Facebook. They use cookies and other mechanisms in order to see what what your browsing history is and they use that to, to target advertising to you in Facebook. And uh, there's a really simple way to avoid having Facebook track your browsing history and with you still being able to use Facebook. So if you, the, the first thing you need to do is get Chrome and you can just go to www.chrome.com and download that web browser. And uh, once you have Chrome up, what you want to do is go to File, New Incognito Window, and then just go to Facebook.com. And notice that there's a spy in the top right corner of your window. And that means that you're browsing in an incognito window. And this is a separate, isolated uh, browser that does not track any of your history and it does not uh, accept cookies so and uh, it's gonna ask me about that I have a new device and you can just type in whatever and it'll send you a, an, an alert this is a, this is actually a really great thing that Facebook does uh, that so that you know every time someone logs into Facebook on a, on a device that they're not familiar with um, so now you can log in and just keep this window separate if you're going to use Facebook and then any other regular Chrome window will not be tracked by Facebook. So you can go to the New York Times and Facebook will not know that you are doing that. So that's the way to do it and then when you're done with Facebook you can just close out of there and you're done.